Right, this is a video about the basics of lock picking. You never know in an urban or suburban type of situation, there may be a time when you've got to get in something or get out of something with a lock on it. I'll just go run through this. This is your <coughs> cylinder lock. This is the front view of it. And these are springs, two sets of pins, and this is the key way where the key would go in. But without the key in, the pins fall across the top part into the bottom of the cylinder. So it'd be like how this pen is, slots inside and turns. Well, imagine the pin going through both of them, it wouldn't turn. And that's how that is. And this is this here. So there's the top pin there, and there's the bottom pin there. And as it goes through both of these, it stops it turning. So when the key is put in, it lines them all up and it makes it turn. Now this is a picture of the key in the lock and where it goes in it lines up all the pins so it's not like this one anymore here so this would be like this now And because the pins have lined up, it'll allow it now to turn freely. So what you've got to do when you're lockpicking, we've got to do the same as this. We've got to line all these pins up. The basic idea to do the lockpicking is... You have to have a tension tool, which is a bar, flat bar, with a curve on it. And that would go in, this part here, would go in the bottom of the lock, and then we'll protrude out like this. And it would go inside. So it would be like this, here. And then you can have various different shaped picks with different ends, all manner of different things. We'll go into them later. And this has to go in go inside. push the pin up in line. The way you do this is you put a slight bit of tension on your tension tool, push up, and it should be just enough to push it up and hold it in place. This is the theory, and then you do the next one, the next one, the next one. Some people work from the back to the front, front to the back, or some people stick it in, wiggle it around, do whatever. And then once you've pushed them up, and then you're still holding it with the tension tool. These will gradually all line up. Some people have a lot of trouble at the back. We'll do one later and we'll try it.